Hi everyone and welcome to SCSP's YouTube channel. The tool that we'll be discovering today is called Eyewitness. An Eyewitness is an information gathering tool. If you don't have it already on your systems, then you can clone it from the GitHub repository. So you can see, you can just clone it using this link here. It has a nice description, it has a setup information, usage, examples and everything. So I've already gone ahead and cloned it onto my system. We can just see it over here. Now before you use Eyewitness, you have to install it. And for that you go to the setup folders and then you run the setup.sh file. So let's begin. To run the tool, you simply run eyewitness.py. I'm doing dash h for help. So now we have we have the help command. So now you can see eyewitness is a tool used to capture screenshot from a list of URLs. So before you use the tool, you must have a list of URLs or a list of subdomains that you want to check. Then next we have protocols. Here I'm going to be using the web protocol, which is basically I'm going to take screenshots of the HTTP and HTTPS responses. Then we have the input options for file name. You can set up the timeouts, the threads, etc. And then you have the dash D for the directory name. This is the directory in which the, your report will be stored. So before this, let me show you the URL list. So this is the URL list I'll be running eyewitness against. Now, web for web protocol, dash f for file name, dash d for your directory, and then timeout, I'm going to set it to 50. So now we can see Eyewitness is running, it has 9 hosts in that list and now it will start to screenshot each of the URLs. So basically why would you use Eyewitness? When you are doing your reconnaissance phase or when you are doing your testing phase, you may come across certain targets that have multiple subdomains like hundreds and two hundreds of subdomains. So you don't have the time to manually test each and every one of those domains. Like you don't have the time to write the URL on the browser and then run it and see what is on that web page. So what Eyewitness does for you is that it automatically screenshots every single web page and it shows you uh, a web request as well and you can get all that information just from running the tool. So it saves time. So you can see here it's attempting to screenshot, There, it hit a few timeouts. Let's just let this run. Now it's done and you can see the report is written to this folder. If I type here Y, I can see the report. So now the report is categorized into a few categories. You can see over here it a few errors, 404s, 401s and so on. Now here you can see it went to exploitdb.com. It took a screenshot of that website and now you can see what's on the website. You can also see the tokens and the web request all of that information here's another screenshot and another one so you can basically get the whole idea that what web pages are running what are not which are not running and so on so here you can see a few errors access denied and so on so this tool really comes in handy when you have a lot of subdomains and you would just want to check what whether each one is running what's running on it and so on thanks for watching